we're the only western state that has snow removal operations and didn't have at least one tow plow in their fleet. We started looking at tow plows about a year and a half ago, what they can do for us, and putting tow plows into our fleet allows us to find some operational efficiencies that we need to offset our, our reduction in manpower. Do 11 feet 2 inches and clear 11 foot lane and go to the interstate. Bob Leonard is a retired traffic engineer from Missouri DOT. He invented that tow plow. It's clearing 13 feet wide. He will go to all locations when they purchase a tow plow and he'll spend time with the operators training them how to operate the tow plow, training them how to do their walk arounds, inspect the equipment, what to look for. He was very excited to have actual snow operations to train for the tow plow. This has been a real unique opportunity and a, and a major change for me in training. I mean we had a routine training schedule on Monday and then you had this snowstorm come in. Your operators are now doing high performance snow removal on an Interstate 40. The benefit of a tow plow basically is you're increasing productivity. You would be out there using two trucks, two engines, two steering wheels and two operators, where now you got one operator, one engine, one steering wheel, and you only got one engine burning fuel. With the front plow on the conventional plow truck and then the tow plow itself with a 26 foot moldboard, that tow plow allows us to clear two lanes at one time. So the bottom line is, is you will see about a 30% reduction in, in snow removal costs. The cost of a tow plow is $140,000, where we would normally have to replace one of our older trucks with a brand new truck at a cost of $280,000. This tow plow can replace trucks at a much more efficient cost and much more efficient operation. The tow plow is designed to operate at speeds of around 55 mile an hour. That's dependent upon visibility and road conditions. So that really helps the flow of traffic. Now, the volume of interstate commerce via semis that are driving on I-40 is 500 trucks per hour, 24-7, 365 days a year. The general public has no idea what the DOT does to keep the roads open by just plowing snow. It seems simple, but if you get behind Mother Nature and all of a sudden you lose your interstate and it shuts down, it has tremendous cost to the public and the movement of commerce. When you see a tow plow in operation and he's blocking the road in front of you, he is providing a good driving surface from you. You do not want to pass him. If you do, you're going to be driving on snow and ice. And that's why it's very important for people to stay back from our plow trucks and give them the room they need to operate so they can keep the roads clear. ADOT, keeping Arizona moving.